What's up guys, Brett here today, and as always, I have another MOAB video, because I've just been struggling to get amazing gameplays, and it just ends up being easier to get a MOAB video, so I, I decided to make this video a little more of a breakdown video on how to actually get a MOAB, and uh, especially on the map bootleg, because a lot of people like to know how to get MOABs, but um, they don't know how, and uh, obviously, but there's, there's not like too much to it, obviously you gotta be a little bit of a better player, if that makes sense, obviously. Uh, but uh, there's several ways you can do it. My way is very mm, quick, <laughs> I guess. If you do it my way, uh, the chances of you getting it probably are lower, but uh, it's definitely more fun, and uh, it might be more frustrating even. But uh, I've never really tried the stay back and sit back and wait for the enemies to come to you, but I'll push up on them. And you want to, like, what I like to do is get it to to their, like, um, spot on the map where they have the flag captured, and then uh, hopefully my my teammates don't capture the flag right beside um, uh, where, where they are but in this gameplay they did and of course uh, you want to be using a silencer pretty standard obvious little tip there because uh, just from a silencer these guys don't know exactly where I am and I've been hopping back and forth between this little spot here and I'm just taking guys out very very quickly and uh, this is gonna be very helpful later on when I'm getting higher up to the kill streak because um, I, I just don't get as impatient as quickly because if I'm on like 20 kills and it's only been like a minute or two minutes or so, then like I'll be patient to get that last five kills and I won't run out and kill myself. And I heard this guy, uh, Sitra Pro, is fantastic, guys. You should try it out. Even if you don't have a headset, you can still hear footsteps, enemy footsteps, much, much louder, and it's it's great. And uh, I think I got this Moab without even dying, so... And look at this challenge. I challenged a sniper. Shouldn't have done that. I, I just ran away because I knew he had a sniper rifle, and I just just ran away because I could not win that situation. I was probably going to get sniped if I didn't run, so that was a smart play by me. You gotta use your weapon to your advantage. And uh, P90, you want to have close range and uh, always have the head, go head glitch cover. You want to always have the cover advantage over the enemy and uh, pay attention to your radar, <laughs> Raid radar, radar. Because uh, that's uh, obviously pretty standard as well. It, it just gives a majority of the um, players on the minimap, but not all of them. All well, Some of them are going to have Assassin. In this lobby, I was pretty lucky. Most of them did not have Assassin. So it was quite helpful in that sense. And uh, here comes my teammate trying to cap that flag. And I was a little nervous here running out, but uh, I see my teammates out there. So I assumed it would be uh, pretty protected. But uh, it wasn't actually, uh, I'm looking around right now, I don't know where they are, I don't know where the enemy team is, and I just want to get the hell out of this situation, I do not like it, and my teammates are too scattered for me to know exactly where the enemies are spawning, and they have the C flag, and I, I just don't know where they are, so I, I get out of there, I try to pick off um, a few guys, kind of in my range of distance, medium range to close range with the P90, and uh, oh man, like, uh, there was a few instances where I should have died, and this one guy, I, I, I don't even remember his name, like, Boy Meets World or something, I killed him so many times, and I ended up, I, I pretended I was fear crowds this game, I tried to get uh, 100 kills with specialists, but uh, unfortunately I couldn't, uh, as you can see there, I get the Moab, and uh, there's only 50 points captured in the game, and then I, I, did, I didn't, I didn't, bleh, I couldn't do that well for the rest of the match, Ended up getting um, 70 kills, 11 deaths, but uh, not the best gameplay, but the Moab was pretty cool. So I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Thanks for watching. Like and favorite if you did. Peace.